Russia's sudden invasion of Ukraine is the biggest state-on-state -state attack in Europe since World War II. And while it might be more than a thousand miles away, it could have wide-ranging effects on the UK. Already, it has led to multi-year highs in commodity prices and tighter supplies, raising the prospects that it will deepen Britain's cost of living crisis. Russia is the world's second largest oil exporter and Europe relies on it for 40% of its natural resources. Even before the crisis escalated, consumer energy bills were due to rise. But wholesale gas prices could surge further if Russia hits back at Western sanctions and cuts off supplies. Already the US and Germany have taken steps to block Nord Stream 2, a controversial pipeline from Russia, and this could anger the Kremlin. Oil prices have hit their highest level in seven years, and experts fear it's only a matter of time until this disrupts supply chains. As delivery prices go up, so too could the price of food and many other goods. Also, as the warring countries account for a third of the world's wheat exports, and most of their ports have been shut, supply chains could take a huge hit, leading to high demand and even higher prices. It's not just the food industry that could be affected. The travel industry is waiting with bated breath. Experts warn that drivers could see fuel prices hit £1.55 a litre. In response to Britain's ban on Aeroflot, UK flights to and over Russia have been banned. As airlines avoid Ukrainian airspace too, it could push up the cost of flying and disruptions to shipping routes will raise prices more. Sports have taken a hit, as the Champions League final and Formula One won't be hosted in Russia as planned. And when it comes to tech, fears of sanctions have increased prices of important metals like copper and aluminium. Aerospace industries depend on titanium from Russia, and neon, palladium and platinum are critical for microchip production. In 2021, shortages of microchips were already a major problem as well as watching for inflation, commodity surges and supply chain issues, Britain is also on the lookout for cyber attacks. Lloyds, Britain's largest domestic bank, says it is on top alert. For now, all Britain can do is brace itself for the consequences of Russia's war. I'll get that little piece of dandruff off.